Hi! In this circuit, we use the components like the tilt sensor in place of reed magnetic sensor due to non-availability of the component in Tinkercad and buzzer along with the power indicator circuit we built earlier. Let's build this circuit in Tinkercad and simulate it. We will first build the common power supply circuit. Let's draw the components mentioned on the circuit diagram seen earlier. So we will draw the USB standard A connector LED red and resistor of value 1 kilo ohms. We will connect as follows the 5 volt positive of the USB to the terminal 2 of the resistor. This is the positive line. So we shall select the wire color red terminal 1 of the resistor to the anode of the LED, cathode of the LED to the ground of the USB connector. This is negative line. So we shall select the wire color black. We will now complete the rest of the circuit for which we shall draw the push button and the buzzer from the component library and wire them as follows. Terminal 2 of the tilt sensor to the terminal 2 of the resistor. Terminal 1 of the tilt sensor to the positive of the buzzer. Negative of the buzzer to the cathode of the LED. We have now completed the circuit. Let's start the simulation. Glowing red LED indicates the circuit is powered, but the buzzer is not sounding as the circuit is open. When we tilt the sensor in hardware, we bring the magnet near to the sensor and close the circuit the buzzer sounds. When we tilt the sensor back, the circuit is open again and the buzzer does not sound. This is how a reed or a tilt sensor works. This circuit has many applications. A few examples could be automatic door locks, speed sensors, and so on. You can now build your own circuit. Download the image file and submit in the assignment. Circuit explanation. In this project, the current flows in two paths. The path one is a power indicator circuit seen earlier in project one. When powered up, the red LED glows, indicating that the circuit is powered. Tilt the sensor. The sensor gets activated and closes its switch for the electric current flow from the positive 5 volt terminal of the USB through the tilt sensor and then through the buzzer to ground negative, completing the path 2 and forming a closed circuit. As soon as the current flows in the closed circuit, the buzzer starts emitting a sound till the sensor is tilted. When the tilt sensor is brought back to its original position, the path is interrupted because of its switch opening and therefore the buzzer goes off. In place of read sensor, tilt sensor is used due to non-availability of the component in Tinkercad. Bring the magnet in close proximity to the read sensor to activate the sensor in case of hardware. Till the magnet is in close proximity to the sensor, read sensor acts as a closed switch. The buzzer emits sound. When the magnet is taken away from the read sensor, the path is interrupted because of its switch opening and therefore the buzzer goes off. Have fun! Cheers!